Hi, what's up YouTube? How y'all doing? So I have this portable fan because currently there's no light. <laughs> I am in um, Abuja, Nigeria and the usually Nepa usually takes light. So yeah, so right now I am over here with no AC, no light. We could run the generator, but I just feel like it's a waste of gas and money and fuel because they're gonna bring the light back in a little bit. So for now, I'm just gonna have to deal with it. So let me make sure there's no lipstick on my teeth. Cause sometimes when I film, I get lipstick on my teeth. Okay, so. I wanted to basically come on here and talk to you guys. The reason why I wanted to talk to you guys is, let me build this camera. So the reason why I wanted to talk to you guys is, I wanted to basically introduce myself and let you know who I am. Um, like I mentioned earlier in the video, my name is Nubian Princess. I am Nigerian. I was born in um, the USA, in America. I grew up in Nigeria for a little bit till I was like let's say 10 or 11 and then I came over to the US but prior to that while I was in Nigeria we would come back and forth to the US so when we finally made that final move it wasn't like a big transition it was almost like I didn't feel it at all <laughs> so the reason why I gave you that background story is because of this um, I grew up on the American side and then I have always had like this attachment and this calling to be in Nigeria like I miss Nigeria ever since we left I felt like I was tricked <laughs> I wasn't supposed to leave but it's all good um, I am grateful for the opportunity that I got while I was in America um, but right now as I get older and want to settle down and all that good stuff, I would like for whoever I'm with to be possibly a Nigerian. Um, I know that I am really big on an African man. I'm open to any tribe, any... Hold on, guys. My phone is ringing. Give me one second. I'm back. Sorry about that. So, like I was saying, I'm always, I've always been big on um, trying to go back to Nigeria, not to stay like permanently, but to have like a home base in Nigeria and also have a home base or continue to have my home base in America. So, I've been really eager to find a Nigerian man. And at first, I was like trying the online thing and I just... It wasn't working, you guys. It was terrible. Like, I was coming across some fraudsters, some people that were pretending to like you, people that wanted to use you, people that wanted to... It was just it was just a mess. Nobody really takes dating serious anymore. Nobody is into the whole courting and taking you out. Everybody just wants to go straight to the bedroom. Like, I'm, I'm not interested in that. It, that's not what I'm here for. So... I basically took a step back um, and decided to just get closer to God and build my relationship with God. So right now, my focus was trying to maintain as far as spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. And God was the center of all of that. So once I did that, I just kind of took a step back. So I have stories and I have updates to give you guys. And I have so many, so many stories. <laughs> so I don't want to give away too much. I just want you guys to know that this is going to be interesting. And it's not just going to be me on here. It's going to be me and me and boo. So stay tuned, you guys. But again, I just wanted to come on here and introduce myself. So I am... A little bit older than so-called the Gen Z or the millennial generation 
in fact i'm gonna be honest with you i am 38 years old i will be 39 um as of june of this year so i cannot wait and so yeah it took me 39 well i started dating at 18. so let's do the math let's do the math 39 minus 18 took me 20 to 21 years to finally find someone that I honestly consider to be my best friend, my future. I'm really happy that I'm really, really happy. So thank you guys for watching. I know it sounds like I'm whispering. But it's too hot to have a lot of energy right now. So whenever they bring the light back, Nepa, please. Whenever they bring the light back, I am definitely going to make a better video. So for now, just make sure you hit that subscribe and like button. So that way you can capture everything that Chi and Chi has to show you. My initial of my first name is C-H-I. His initial of his first name is C-H-I. That's how we got the Chi and Chi for life. <laughs> All right, guys. So thank you guys so much for subscribing and for watching. And make sure you thumbs up and like the videos. Have a blessed day. Bye.